Who the heck was that running? <laughs> Alright guys, and welcome back to what should be the last episode of Outlast. It's been a terrifying experience and I'm finally glad to be done with it. Although it just occurs to me that we still have the DLC and Outlast 2 to play, so... Anyway, in the last episode, we've managed to lose our camera and now we've got to navigate through the dark to find it. Oh boy, wish me luck. Alright, so I think we have to jump down because there's no way else to go around. Oh my god, you need your camcorder to navigate the darkness. Yes, I know. <laughs> you don't have to tell me that. Uh, I think... Yeah, let's just make our way down and hope that we do not encounter anybody please i'm just trying to find my way out of this shitty ass place so oh boy this is going to suck i can already feel it hey hello why am i stuck there we go okay Ooh, what was that what was that Is there somebody there? Okay, I hope not. Uh, hello? Excuse me, what is that? Is that a battery? Oh my god, I can't even see anything, man. Yeah, pick up a battery. What good is a battery right now if I don't have my freaking camcorder, man? Uh, huh. Jesus Christ, man. Alright, okay. Let's hit. Oh my god, this is just 10 times scarier. I can't see anything, man. Someone taking a shower? Hello? <laughs> it would be really funny if someone was really, really taking a shower over there. But nope. Alright. Oh, this is going to suck. Balls. Okay, let's see if we have anything over here. No, we don't? Sure? Cool? I think we still have the twins chasing our asses and we have... Jesus Christ. Can we open this door? Oh, I see something in there. There's a battery in there, can I not take it? Oh my god. Who the heck was that running? Oh! <laughs> Fucking hell, man! Oh. oh boy, I can't wait for this game to be over and done with. Once I'm. Who the heck is standing there? Once I'm done with this game, <laughs> I'm probably not going to play the DLC for. One week. I'm gonna wait a week. Then I play the DLC. Um, whoa, 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 guys. Uh, have you seen my camera? It's a Canon? Or maybe a Nikon? I, I don't know. My oh, man, the game sure is making it hard for us if you can't see shit, right? Press X to close. Close what? Where the fuck are we supposed to go, man? Alright. Uh, I hope... <laughs> I hope. Big word over there. I hope this is the way. <gasps> oh, there we go. Can I pick it up from here? No, I can't. I hear somebody running around. Oh boy. All right. Please tell me I have all my berries. Oh shit. Oh my god, why there's so many of them there, man? Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Jesus Christ, man. Please. I can't even see shit, bro. Is it? Oh, here, here, here. 
Mouse, come on, run, you little ass. Why is he running so slow? Guys. Oh my god. Seriously? You guys gotta do this to me right now. Oh, oh, oh. This is the same way we came. Please, up, up, up. Let me jump up. Oh, thank fuck for that. Alright, okay, we have our camera. Oh, thank god. And our camera has a big giant crack in it. This shitty ass camera, man. Seriously, Miles. <laughs> now, where? Seriously, how is that there? Alright, so I went back down to where we found our camera and it turns out it wasn't the right way. We were supposed to go here. <laughs> and I did not see that. So, wasted the battery. But it's all good. It's all good. Okay, now that we're here. The fuck? Oh, ow, I think we're supposed to go back. To... When we drop the camera. There we go. Yeah, that's where I think we're supposed to go. Seriously, I just wasted a whole battery trying to figure that out. Oh, the crack on my camera is making me a little uneasy. Is this way? There we go. Okay, so now that we have our camera, we can we can navigate through this shitty ass place. Find Father Martin. Do we really have to find that asshole? I swear, I thought I saw something shining on the floor. Follow the blood. Okay. Ah, Jesus Christ. Whew. We are supposed to go up, right? Saving. Guys, do you have insurance? Because your entire floor is falling apart. Alright, I think we're supposed to I think we're supposed to drop. Nope. Alright, let's try that again, shall we? I think we're supposed to cross. Uh, this way. That's right. And drop it this way. Ooh. Hi. Hi, sir. I'm just coming through. Please don't hit Only me. Only one way out. Only one way. Okay, one way out. I know, I know. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and close this door. <laughs> Thank you. See you. Come again. Bye bye. How do you know you're not a patient? Because I'm not a freaking patient, man. Whoa. Did my screen just stutter? I think it did. Alright. Uh, I'm not too good with tight spaces. Please nobody jump out at me. Please. <laughs> okay, saving. Fuck. That's Chris Walker. What? Whoa, 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 bro. Go in, go in. Is there anything I can grab over here? Oh my god, it's Chris. Chris is coming. Why is he everywhere, man? Seriously. <laughs> the guy has nothing else better to do. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Alright, this, this is gonna stop you for a while. Run, 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 run! Run, you fool! Oh! Oh, oh, oh. Jump! Oh, thank god. Okay, okay. Oh my god. Thank god we did that. Oh, boy. Hey! What's up, bro? <laughs> you hiding from Chris Walker too? <laughs> so am I. <laughs> Although, I don't think... Yeah, I think... The guy is not taking a nap. <laughs> oh boy. I'm sorry. Why is my game dropping frames, man? Alright. Ooh! Hey, we're back! 
We're back at where we came from. This is where Chris threw us off. <gasps> Can we go back to our car? Oh shit. The library. This is where the dude got spiked, right? Do we have anything over here? Can we not escape from this? Alright. Uh, translated from German, Berlin, uh, Dr. Matt Rog. I have pressing news concerning the ongoing work of Dr. Rudolf Wernicke in his development of the morphogenic engine, expanding on the theories it developed in his brief but unfortunate relationship with A. Turing. Is it, is, isn't it Alan Turing? What, did, what was he famous for? Uh, I can't remember. If I had not witnessed it myself, I would not believe it had happened. But beyond even the promise in cellular regeneration and guided cancer, cancer generation, I believe Wernicke's method has reached the spiritual realm. Something has crossed from the other side. I personally witnessed the appearance of an apparition, briefly but undeniably so. Please forward my note and invitation to witness further experiments of uh, sorry please forward my note and invitation to witness further experiments to Dietrich Eckhart I do not doubt that the Führer himself may need be made aware of our discoveries it's my opinion that Dr. Wernicke's successes represents an enormous opportunity for our cause and the German people and are obviously sufficient reasons to keep him out of any sort of culling program regards to your family Signa signature illegible all right. Can we not exit from here? Oh, why would we be able to? It's locked, <laughs> as usual. So let's hop on this way, I guess. Okay, thank you for your help. But I totally did not get what the fuck he just said. Alright, uh, retrieve the key from the recreation hall. Uh, before you go, do you have a battery you can spare? I guess not. <laughs> Alright, recreation hall. Okay, this is... Alright. Please camera, don't give up on me. Okay, he said something about a recreational hall and watching a movie. So... Do we go up? Okay, before we go, I think we're supposed to hit up. Uh, there's a closet to hide. That's not good. <laughs> Alright, it's locked. So we do have to go up. Guys, I would really appreciate it if you give me a battery and please nobody be at the top of the ladder. Alright. Okay, nothing shiny. Um Alright. Let's have a beer. <laughs> Calm my nerves. I mean this channel it isn't called Sozot for no reason, right? <laughs> uh yep. Down? Thank you. No, it's locked. Why would be why would it be open? Okay, I'm kinda Okay. <laughs> I really don't want it. Stupid camera. I swear to God, when I get out of here, I'm, I'm writing a scathing review to the camera company that sold me this camera, man. Oh, sure. Go through this door. Wait, what? Are we not allowed to? All right. There we go. Ah, saving. Okay, we got uh, exit interview recorded December twenty seventh, nineteen eighty five in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Let's find a corner. 
Alpha subject, Dr. Rudolf Wernicke, 14866. This is Unreal. Uh, there was no alteration to the footage at all, no trickery? None. In June of 1943, you recorded three instances of spontaneous bleeding. Uh, half a dozen test subjects began to develop brain tumors? Yes. The autopsies revealed that the tumors were pure dead. It killed them? Can you explain why the results could not be reproduced in the United States? I have my theories. My homeland in those years. It's impossible to understand the things we felt, what we believed. The overwhelming fear, ecstatic rage, and English birds are insufficient. More than hope. A human mind in this environment is capable of extraordinary things. You're saying the experiment needed... The proximity to this, to overwhelming madness. Only a test subject who had witnessed that of horror was capable of activating the engine. Do you believe your test subjects achieved something supernatural? No. Do you think that they contacted something supernatural? Nothing is supernatural. Then what was it? You said Project Wallrider was a gateway. A gateway to what? Hello? <laughs> a gateway to? Um... Alright, <laughs> I guess the guy's not gonna say anything more? Huh. I'm gonna go ahead and read the note then. The man sounds like Dr. Strangelove's anemic brother. It's a 25-year-old audio recording and interview with this Dr. Wernicke. Los Alamos means government work. Wernicke talks about spontaneous bleeding, tumors, psychosomatic reactions in sufficiently disturbed people. Seems to walk a line between science and Nazi mythicism. Only a test subject who had witnessed enough horror was capable of activating the engine, the morphogenic engine. The engine, the, in, the engine, the movie they're projecting gets in my head like a song you can't stop humming. I blink I, and I see Ross Rosarch tests that look like swarming insects and infected surgery wounds. The patients talk about using the engine to conjure the wall rider. It's the buzzing I hear in my bones. Miles, seriously? Alright, uh, so I think we gotta exit through here. And once you're done with that, uh, I'm gonna grab the key. Uh, okay. Oh, blood. Blood is always not good. Sure, bro. Whatever you do. do. Whatever you do, do. <laughs> Just stay in the damn closet and please don't come out and find me. Alright. Say what? Are we supposed to come through here? No. Oh boy. You know we've been playing for this game for a really what seemed to be a really long time and we've only been reco recording on the camera for 2 hours and 52 minutes and that's how long Miles has been in here. Seems like a few days man. <laughs> Alright so we oh we seem to be in the stupid camera I swear to god. Bro! What the fuck, man? And you leave through there. Could you not have just left the door open for me, you little prick? Alright, so we gotta cross the ledge. Oh, Jesus Christ. This game, I tell you. This game! Is a story like that worth risking your life and not maybe not your life? Two fingers. 
just to get a story like this. Why would you risk your life? Ah, jeez. There we go, key. Nice. Picked up the key to access the third floor. Find Father Martin. Right. Um, I would really appreciate it. I know I sound like a broken record right now, but I would really appreciate it if you guys could give me freaking batteries, please. Thank you very much. Alright, so let's get the hell out of here. And I, for the life of me... Oh hey, a document. Alright, from the bird... Whatever his name is. Uh, wash those hands regularly. Really? I fucking quit. <laughs> Necrotizing facilities. Right, whatever that is. Um, alright. Oh, I think we have to head out through where we came from. Is the guy still in there? Yep, stay there. Don't come out. Nope, 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 nope. Who the fuck is that? Right, let's just go, man. Let's just go. <laughs> what up? See if there's anything in here worth grabbing. I'm down to five batteries. Nope. Alright, cool. <laughs> Be like that then. Don't give me anything. Alright, uh... Oh, sh Jesus, bro. Yep, whatever, man. You stay there. I'm gonna close the freaking door. And you stay there. Oh, jeez, Murkoff. Who the fuck is that dude? Of course we've got to go to the spot where the dude was. Oh my god. Oh wait, wait, wait. <laughs> sure, why wouldn't the elevator need a key? Wait, everything is fucking locked, man. Oh, there's another door here I didn't try. Alright. Oh, boy. I swear, all these spots over here look the same, man. And could you guys stop it with the music, please? Really? <laughs> Alright, cool. <sighs> Cola drinks, sure. Whoa. Do you have any batteries over here, sir? Good man? No? This way? No. No batteries there. Alright, down to four. Hey, <clears throat> excuse me. Why is everybody praying, man? <laughs> you know, if I was in Miles' Miles situation right now, I would have picked up a cue ball or a pull stick. Did not want to do that. I would have picked up a Pool stick and Okay, I'm just gonna leave you be and use it as a weapon man. Alright. Sir, do you guys keep batteries in your room? No? Cool. Any batteries in here, sir? No? Ooh, document. Oops, this way. I am I am unworthy I am an I am an unworthy supplicant who can serve our Lord but only by feeding our Lord. Please take me wall rider. Let my shepherd apostle see it and spread it with his lies for the greater truth. Your time upon the world has come. 
My flesh longs for your beautiful wraith. My blood is filled with you and waiting to be set free. This is my prayer. Write your gospel in my flesh. I don't know about that, bro. Hey, you have a pair of jeans. Put them on, man. Seriously, walking around naked and all. Oh, I didn't. I did not open this door. Ah, jeez, man. I I missed the door. All right, sir. I think I'm supposed to go out here. Do you mind if I use your room? Uh. Ah. Look at that buck ass naked dude, man. Please do not grab me. Thank you very much. Hi, sir. Just coming through. I'll leave you be. I'll close the door. Alright, uh, God hates sickness. Alright, so we aren't supposed to come here. Well, duh. Let's <laughs> hit. God hates money. I mean, quit touching yourself, bro. Seriously, that's not cool, man. Are the twins? Don't mind me. It's going through. Is that Father Martin? Who key? You are surely not resurrecting from dead, man. <laughs> Passion of Father Martin. I can't believe Father Martin won up Jesus Christ himself in shitty ways to die. I don't believe I'm going to miss him. A way out. If he's telling the truth, now I've got a way out and a story to tell. He wants me to spread his gospel. I'll tell the whole fucking world. Yep, sir. <laughs> you are not resurrecting from dead. And why are you two blocking the freaking doors? Alright. I hope. Why, thank you. Thank you. Okay. Just gonna close the door. <laughs> See ya. It was nice knowing you guys. Uh, huh. <laughs> why did they change all of a sudden, man? From wanting to kill me Ooh. to opening doors for me <laughs> I'm not gonna complain though <laughs> opening the doors for me sure beats the hell out of chasing me with freaking knives man all right thank god we are getting out I've been oh my god Hi, 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 hi. Okay, now we've got rid of the twins. And we've got this stupid Chris Walker. Ah, Jesus Christ, man. Alright, you know what? I'm tired of hiding. Should've make a freaking run for it. Oh, fuck! Ooh, what? 
Oh, sir. Oh. I think. Run, run, you little prick. Oh. I don't know why am I not running properly. Oh, there we go. Run. Up, 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 up. Oh, there we go. Oh, my God. I was spending my entire time hiding under the freaking bed and I did not know where I... Oh, oh my God. Finally, the door. We are free. I'm free. Oh, thank God. Okay, now we're going to get out of this shithole. Onto the first floor, right? There we go. Open the door. Open the door. Open the door. <sighs> what are they trying to do to me? And where the fuck have we been going down, man? Find another way out. Um, hello? Uh, are we in the Antarctica? What is with this place, man? Oh my god, this is just an Umbrella Corp, man. A non-discreet shack with nothing on the surface, but when you go all the way down, it's a laboratory full of high-tech stuff. That's Umbrella Corp for you, man. And this Murkoff, whatever the company is, Murkoff Corporation, is just like under... Fuck, fuck, fuck. Whoever finds my cops, trust no one and tell everyone. I'm not crazy. I know, I know. Only crazy people say that, but I am as sane as this world allows with a camera full of evidence. Don't call it the gospel, call it the mockery of reason, let the world know it is Murkoff's fault. Bury these bastards with my mutilated dead body. <laughs> okay, this guy, Miles doesn't seem to think that he'll make it out alive though. I mean, come on man, this is totally Umbrella Corporation, man. Personal records of Dr. Wernicke, Frankenstein, the modern, the modern Prometheus by Mary Shelley, published anonymously in 1818, chapter 23. Man, I cried, how ignorant art thou in thy pride of wisdom. Cease, you know not what it is you say. I broke from the house angry and disturbed and retired to meditate on some other mode of action. Ah, oh, Wall Rider Project. These guys have been watching too much Resident Evil, man. So I suppose this is where we've learned about the whole story, an entire story of why and how all this shit came about. Right, oh my god. Look at that, man. Guts everywhere. Although, I don't feel sorry for these people, man. From the shit that they were experimenting with, they had it coming for them. And who made that sound? Looks like Chris Walker came over here and like, sp spilled their guts, man. Ugh. Why would you even keep heads and hands in a freaking jar, man? It's just sick. Sick, sick, sick. Hey, come on, high-tech laboratories, you guys don't have batteries anywhere. Alright, my camera is making... Eh. Where is this place, man? Look at that, look at that outside. It seems like we're on Mars or something. Morphogeny engine. That's a bunch of crap I will never know how to do. <laughs> it's math. Not good with math. This is the morph morphogeny engine. A few lines of mathematics and an algorithm. Pro reprogram us, turn us into nightmare factories. A few numbers on a dry erase dry erase board. Give me a hacksaw and a few hours alone with Dr. Wernicke's corpse. <laughs> I feel I owe him a debt. Alright. It's 4am I think. <laughs> Wait. 
What? Can I not read the time properly? 10 to 4. Yeah, that looks like we're on Mars, man. You guys watch Starship Troopers? <laughs> That's one of a guilty pleasure. Alright, I don't think there's anything for us over here. Let's go this way. Whoa, 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 what the fuck? What did I do? Oh, hell no! Run! Run, you little bitch! Run! The wall riders on your ass, man! Why are the doors closed? I did not freaking close the doors, man! Someone taking a piss? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! Well, he did. <laughs> um, Chris Walker Juice. <laughs> Ugh, gross. This is the way to die, ripped to pieces from the inside, watching your marrow scatter on the concrete wall. You have escaped, you have escaped one hell, Chris Walker. God help me, but I somehow hope you didn't find another. Alright, so we no longer have Chris chasing our ass. Um, hmm. <laughs> That's good to know. Find another way out. Why well, can't it seem that I'm... F uh, okay. I'm starting to feel like Miles is right, man. I don't think I'm good. Say... Who the fuck are you? Wernicke? Who the fuck is he? Am I missing something? Wait, find Billy in the laboratory. I'm so confused right now. Balance of your doctors and patients amounted to. If 
will spread if you don't stop him. The morphogenic engine is self-perpetuating. I pray to God you have the strength to end it here with your death. With my or death? I want rest. Billy will not let me die. You could never imagine how cruel this is. I only want to die. Huh, so I think the war rider we have been seeing is this Billy guy that is somehow um I don't know how they're projecting his body out. But I've been curious and I was searching on this dude Alan Turing because I remember I heard his name somewhere. This guy is a mathemat mathematician. I yeah, it's an OB uh English mathematician and computer scientist. Oh, so it's cool that they kinda included him into this whole story in Outlast. Very interesting. Alright, uh, Morthobigenic Engine Chamber. So I think that's where we have to go. So I think that was Wernicke. Hold up. I think it's this way. So we're all good now, knowing that we don't have um, Chris Walker chasing after us. So that's cool. Although, I could use some batteries. As always, Miles. Oh my god, there's just a freaking hand over there. Miles, you have to learn to close the door properly, man. I see a camera, but no batteries. Alright, B block. Let's get our asses over there. And there's blood everywhere. So I'm starting to think that all this blood scattered everywhere might not have been Chris Walker's doing, man. Might have been the wall rider. Squishing everybody into little juice boxes. Oh, bro, bro, bro. Damn shit is chasing me, man. Okay, I take that back. We don't have Chris Walker, but we do have this freaking little bitch chasing after us, man. Left or right? What the fuck? Is it this way? Oh shit. Run, 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 run. Oh my god. Fuck me, man. This way, there we go. Now we've got this little bitch chasing after us. Jesus Christ, man. Does this chasing never ever stop? I'm gonna close the freaking door on you. Oh, there we go. Somehow having this wall rider chasing us is not as... Haha, <laughs> you little bitch. Not as tense or scary compared to... What's his name? Chris Walker chasing us. Oh my god, this guy... <laughs> this guy totally has his whole body ripped out, man. Alright, so we're here. In what seems to be like the Antarctica. Holy crap. The assembler, the feed chambers, the precursor molecules, vague memories of nanotechnology articles I've read online, probably drunk, probably distracted. Not nearly enough to know how to destroy it, but Billy is at the center of it. Find him, kill him, end this. Okay, seems like we've entered NASA. Oh shit! Turn off the valve from the life support. Shit, I didn't read that. Uh, for the fluid reservoir. Life support fluid reservoir. Oh my god, is that... Billy, is that you? From Billy's patient's report, he ought to be 23 years old. He looked at least 50 years of rough road pain scratched deep into what I can see. Killing you will be an act of kindness. Oh my god. Is that how? Oh my god, that oh that really must suck for him, man. 
It's like these people are sick doing this, man. Like, they seriously. Um, Markov Psychiatric Systems To avoid patient injury The Morphogeny Engine Life Pod Requires a daily inspection Of all vital systems uh, Vital System 1 The enriched oxygenated pl Perfluorocarbon From the life support fluid reservoir Must be continually flushed Replaced through the corpse Course of the patient's treatment uh, okay, okay I'm not going to read all of these It's just directions On how they should maintain the system But uh, Back to what I was saying If this was the way they were experimenting, experimenting on people. Damn. <laughs> I for one don't feel... Look at this man, it's a ball of blood. I don't feel... Sympathetic. Of what has happened to all these people, man. I mean, the shit that they... Look at this. All this crap. They deserved it, man. But you don't play God this way. Experimenting on all this sh This guy writes a lot in his journal, man. This is Billy Hope's lungs, his liver, his life support. A, machin a machine the size of a football stadium to keep one lunatic alive. Fuck it all. Break it all, he has to die. Alright, I'm with you, man. But how the hell? Oh, there we go. Yeah, I mean, look at all this crap, man. Uh, no, not here. Okay, I guess not. Is there anywhere else we can go? Oh, there we go. Turn off the valve. That's right. Okay, I assume the wall rider is going to come after us right now. <laughs> Did you hear that scream? Shit. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, fuck fuck fuck. Run, run, Forrest, run! Run, Forrest, run! I'm gonna slow you down. Alright, uh, what else do we have to do? Cut off the electric supply from the sub lab generation, so I assume it's this way? There we go. Okay, 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 okay. Run, Forrest, run! Oh, jeez. Why do they need so Why do they have so many stairs, man? Couldn't they have done it on the first floor? Fuck me, there's a lot of stairs. Oh, come on. Stupid camera. I swear to God, man. When I get back, I'm gonna write a scathing review. I know I've said that. It's like you guys have shitty ass cameras with shitty battery life. Oh. There we go. Fuck, am I going the right way? I, ho I really hope so, man. should keep him all right uh hello okay this way look at his fingers man oh my god okay new objective Div disable uh billy's life Ooh, document please find attached uh the permission to proceed from patient william hope of the Murkoff Charitable Psychiatry Program at Mount Massive Hospital in Colorado, USA. The form is a standard and all relevant lines have been signed. It appears that Billy is unaware of his mother's recent guided cardiac arrest. He is submitting to the experiment with the understanding of financial remuneration to his mother and a charitable organization to a church. Wernicke, having read the boy's dream reports, believes he has enormous therapeutic potential. Oh, okay, so... Uh, Billy kind of like a uh, volunteer for this program, but shit, man, I don't think he knew what the total outcome of it 
was. Like, what was he getting himself exactly into? Which... Sorry, bro. I'm gonna kill you right now. For me to live, you have to die. There we go, freaking war riders back. Jump, you little bitch. Oh my god. Run! Are we still alive? How are we still alive, man? Run! Close the door. Oh shit, 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 shit. Oh, oh, I'm not even gonna... Oh my god, stairs. Fucking stairs. Oh, I've got to turn off his shit, shit, right? Here? Oh, I'm sorry, Billy. <laughs> Oh my god, we're totally getting killed, man. Did he just put himself in us? Miles, 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 you should have stayed in your car, you should have never came in, man. New objective, get out. Um, so long, Billy. See ya. Billy's dead, the war rider, the swan, whatever it is, unmade with him. Whether I escape or die here, I am free. Shit. Oh my god, we're limping, man. Oh man, Miles, you should have stayed in your car. Ah, fuck, man, we're not gonna make it. We're gonna die, man. You should have never came in here. Like, would you risk your life for a story? Like, I get that some stories are... Like, you really need to expose the truth. People need to... Re uh, the world needs to know that what some corporations are doing and um yeah i know i get it that some people risk their life for this shit but <laughs> really couldn't you have done it in some other way i don't know that's just me man i, sh I sure as hell would have stayed in my car i would have never gotten out sorry poor mouth film i mean there's no reason to film right now right how are we going to make it out? Oh. That sucks, man. Like the amount of shit that we've been through for the past three or four hours in-game. Oh, help! Oh, you fucking kidding me. well all right <laughs> so it ended just like that so we became the host damn oh my god it sucks for miles man for a dude that was trying to expose this corporation on from an email he received from someone trying to do go there and do good he ends up running for his life fingers getting chopped off and he just happened to die like that oh boy that sucks for him.
Alright guys, so that was the end of Outlast. And I've got to say, for a game that has been so terrifying from the start, the story has really been very interesting. And it sucks that after all the efforts of Miles trying to get the heck out of the asylum, he ended up dying, uh, becoming the host for the War Rider, and it sucks. I mean, up to the last part of the game, I think Miles kind of knew it in him that he would not make it out alive, and... Yeah, I think we will know more about the whole story when we play the DLC, but for now, I'm just gonna take a break from this game. <laughs> yeah, and I'll probably catch you guys in the next one. See ya.